Thank you for staying tuned. You're watching Wake Up Nigeria. And it's time for us to talk health on the show this morning. Uh, to do justice to that, we have Professor Adewale Badirinwa Sunday, an alumni of the International University Medicina Alternativa in Ceylon, Sri Lanka, where he got his Bachelor of uh, Medicine. Uh, from then on, he has traveled the world and has become one of the leading experts in medicine and acupuncture. Today, we'll be exploring neck pains. I can already see so many people doing like this. Like you're, you're already feeling that pain. It's so good to have you here, Professor. How are you doing? It's a pleasure being at these beautiful studios. I, I like your confidence. Thank like you. I, th There was something he said earlier. When we were talking about um, relieving pain by acupuncture, Eddie. you were confident enough to say, if I don't get this right, I'm going to quit my practice. Yes. What gives you that much confidence? Uh, it's because acupuncture therapy works uh, like... Um, can I say incredible? Mm. Um, a lot of people have subscribed the way acupuncture works to the speed of light mm. in some instances. Uh, this is a discovery by the Chinese before the birth of Jesus Christ. Mm. And the, it's spreading around the world now because of some reasons. Um, especially uh, the Chinese invented acupuncture because, um, because of their large population. The number of medical doctors in the ancient China can be counted on the tips of the finger. So mm. they have to evolve other ways of healing themselves. Mm. That was how acupuncture came into being. And since then, it has been spreading to so many parts of the world, mm. uh, including Nigeria. Of course, people have the fear of pins and needles. So many people do. Yes. But before we go into the nitty gritty of it, let's talk about neck pains and yes. acupuncture. Yeah, <clears throat> neck pain generally is um, an underestimated ailment. When you tell some people you're having neck pain, they will say, I just, I just do your neck like this. It's not this like that. the way you slept. Uh, yes. <laughs> and that is why Yoruba, in their wisdom, use a very powerful proverb. I'm going to say it in Yoruba. They say, buru onu <laughs> didun The meaning of that is that your misfortune will start when you start having neck pain. Hmm. It doesn't mean if you have neck pain, yeah, you, are, you, are, you are unfortunate. <laughs> But the way you manage it, take for example, let's say you travel somewhere and they give you a pillow, mm. which is not the usual pillow you used to, you used to uh, sleep with, and then you have a pain in your neck. The first person you will turn to is your spouse. Mm. Darling, I'm having pain in my neck. And that one will turn himself to an emergency chiropractor. He'll be turning your left, left ah. and right, mm. uh, like uh, the jar of uh, the ancient Bedford. Mm -hmm. When you do that, you are going to cause the problem, the person a lot of problem, mm. which could even cause mental ailment as time goes on. The reason is when the brain is uh, transiting to spinal cord, mm. the transition starts at the upper part of the neck, just close to the medulla oblongata. Mm. And it comes in three segments, the pia, arachnoid, and dua, which are uh, encapsulated in the meninges. Mm. When you have an infection of the meninges or an inflammation, it's called meningitis. Mm. So when you subject the neck to that kind of shaking, mm. um, it's going to distort the arrangement of those three layers. And, and when that happens, it's going to cause complications. Oh. So it's always better when you have pain in your neck. The first thing you do is, is that you take a pain reliever. Mm. If the pain reliever will not do, seek for a medical attention. Or better still, you can prepare an ice, put ice uh, in a cellophane. Cellophane means a nylon. Mm -hmm. Crush it, wrap it around your neck mm. to bring you some relief. If the relief does not uh, go, if the relief does not come, mm. you can now start saying, let me go to the hospital. Mm -hmm. Now, let's assume you go to the hospital. They give you the same analgesic which they would anyway. Mm -hmm. Some might refer you to a physiotherapist. Mm -hmm. But if the pain still persists, that would be a time to visit an acupuncturist. Wow. So when you've explored everything medical, yes. then why not just start from acupuncture? In the uh, that is time. if you have an acupuncturist close by, uh -huh. you know. Acupuncture is so wonderful to the extent that even when your, lock, when your neck is locked, mm. we call it frozen neck. Mm. In other words, you cannot maintain the usual 180 degrees, which your neck should assume anyway. Mm -hmm. You should be able to do this, do this. But then when you want to do this, you can't. Acupuncture can unfrozen frozen it within a tinkle of Some people high. have been living with that for years now. Uh, so yes. you're, you're saying that n despite the amount of years you might have lived with frozen neck or yes. stiff neck, as some people call yes. it, you can actually get relief through acupuncture. Acupuncture has done that so many times. And the, the, the most uh, surprising thing about acupuncture is that you may not even put the needle anywhere around the neck. Mm -hmm. 
We are going to put the needle somewhere around here. This is the point. Okay, so I'm suffering from neck pain right now. Yes. And I know quite well that you have your acupuncture. My needles are here. Is there something you can do to help me? Why not? Okay, please. I can, I can fix it. Okay. And please. you will confess to the whole world that the pain has gone. Okay. Acupuncture is as sure as a I'm, day I'm, and night. I'm looking forward to you know? this. So this is it. Okay. I am going to... What you will do for me is clench your fist like this. Okay, like this. Yes. When you clench the fist, okay. this is the point I want to use. Okay. The Chinese call this point ouchi. Ouchi. It's not the ouchi in Edo State, too. <laughs> but the spelling of this ouchi is H-O-U-C-H-I. It's in SI3. Okay. This is the best point to a frozen, um, frozen neck. Okay. Now I'm going to do it. Because this point is located between the white and black skin, it may be a bit... But let me just put it. That's it. Oh, boy. Ow! Release your hand. Release it a bit. Yeah. Is it supposed to hurt? No, it's not. Your skin is tough. Aha, that's it. My skin is tough. Yes. Okay. <laughs> so let's see what happens. Then you should be able to... Now, okay. turn your neck. Turn it. Yes. Turn it oh, to wow. the other side. Okay, I don't feel the pain here anymore. Yes, that turn, it, turn it to the other side. This okay. way. Yes, 180. And it's uh -uh. done. That's it. <clears throat> Okay, I, I promise you it's not magic. <laughs> <laughs> it's not magic. But I actually do not feel the pain anymore. Yes, that's acupuncture for you, you know. Yes, that's what it does. It gives you that instantaneous effect. Wow. And a lot of people felt, well, there must be something behind acupuncture. People always ask me, do you soak the needle inside one concussion or something? I said, no. It was actually sealed. It's sealed. It was sealed. You know? Yeah. So it is, that's the power because of... Because you also have to look out for other yes, diseases. Yes, that's the power of Chinese acupuncture. Mm -hmm. And it's not only in frozen neck, it, uh, it, 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 it takes care of so many ailments. For example, if you're having dysmenorrhea, you're having painful menstruation, you can put your needle somewhere there in the leg and the pain goes away. You know what? I'm pretty sure you're hooked to this and I'm pretty sure you don't want to miss the next time Professor comes on the show, which is next Tuesday. You want to keep your fingers crossed and keep watching. Thank you so much for your time. It's been it's a pleasure quite an interesting here. time. Thank you. I feel a lot better. <laughs> we'll take this break. You're watching Wake Up Nigeria. Just Thank stay you. with us. My goodness.